Hi, so this is something that I've wanted to do for a while. I wanted to create a mindfulness practice to put on my YouTube page. So this is where I am. I've been teaching mindfulness to children and adults for the past few years and I love it. And with the current state of affairs, I'm in my home as many people are, I wanna still teach and I still wanna offer it to people because it's keeping me sane and keeping me in touch with gratitude and joy and all the good things in life. And I think everybody deserves that. So um, meditation and mindfulness are a bit different, although they do kind of cross over a little bit. So I'm gonna give like a super short explanation of the differences. Meditation is present moment awareness, non-judgmentally, present momently, bleh. Mindfulness is non-judgmental, present moment awareness. And what that means is just being aware of what's going on right now, your behavior, your thoughts or feelings in the moment, your interactions with people, and um, not thinking about the past or the future. The what ifs and the should ifs, right? We live in that. Actually, there's been a study, Harvard did a study, 46.8% um, of our time is not thinking about the present moment. So like 50% of our lives, we are not in the present moment. And that became so very important to me when I had kids and I realized that I was missing 50% of their life because I was thinking about something that happened in the past or worrying about the future. That had to change because I wanted to be in 100% of their lives. Not to mention the thinking about the future gave me stress through the roof. So if I didn't change that, I was definitely gonna miss that. And it also, it increased my anxiety not being in the present. So mindfulness increases present moment awareness. Meditation is about going inside and inner. And so that also includes mindfulness, but meditation is more focusing inward to increase calmness, concentration, and uh, emotional balance, which is inside of mindfulness. Does that make sense? So mindfulness is kind of a all encompassing. You can carry it with you in your pocket type of thing. You don't need to sit and close your eyes. You just are increasing your present moment awareness of what's happening in your body. All right. Benefits of mindfulness are this. Um, it, it increases your ability to regulate your emotions. So we're less likely to fly off the handle with anger, anxiety, stress, worry, when we can kind of read the current situation. Um, it, so it'll decrease your stress, it'll increase your focus, which by the way, if you're on a device, shoop, shoop, scrolling, that is actually decreasing your focus length. So our focus as a population has actually gone down, but mindful practice increases it back up. Um, it increases your joy. And I always say the more joy you have, the more freedom you have, and that's what we want. We wanna feel free and joyful, and so, this does that. It doesn't cost anything. It's free. You can practice it anywhere. It's empowering. It increases your presence, your interaction with people, your connection, your relationships, your gratitude. Do I need to go on or does that make enough sense? I think it makes enough sense. All right. So how the hell do you do it? It's quite simple. You can find a comfortable place to sit. You can lie down if you want. I like to sit alert because if I'm tired, I'm gonna fall asleep. You can close your eyes, or if that makes you uncomfortable, you can keep them open. You can glance down at the ground. You can look at something beautiful, um, a cloud, a flower, a bug, and come into your body. Allow everything to settle. Allow the weight of your body to sink into your space. And go ahead and fill your lungs up with a big, deep breath. Start with a deep, deep breath. Keep going, keep going. Fill up till you can't fill up anymore. And then slowly breathe it out through your nose. So your mouth stays closed. You're gonna breathe just like you're breathing all day long. Unless, of course, you have a stuffy nose, in which case, feel free to breathe out your mouth. So now continue breathing in and out naturally. You don't have to change your breath. You don't have to have a deep breath. Just allow it to be. This is where the non-judgmental part comes in. You're not doing it wrong. You're just doing it. Just breathe.
Now the next time you inhale, I want you to imagine it going up into your head. When you exhale, I want you to imagine all those places all over the, all over the face, all the muscles on the face relaxing. As you exhale, I want your temples to relax, your forehead, the space between your eyebrows, your jaw. Inhale into your head again. And this time I want you to imagine all those plates around your brain relaxing. Your brain relaxes, your ears, the space behind your ears relax. We're just gonna tie our breath awareness and our body awareness together over the next few minutes. On an inhale, inhale long and fill up that space all around your neck, from the front to the back of your neck. On an exhale, I want you to imagine relaxing your vocal cords, your throat, the back of your neck, the front of your neck. On an inhale, send the breath into your shoulders. Exhale, relaxing. Your shoulders might even come down an inch or so. Feel that relaxing across the front of your shoulders, the back of your shoulders, wrapping around your shoulders. Inhale all the way down both arms. Exhale, feel the upper arm relax, the lower arm, the forearm. Now inhale all the way into your fingertips. Exhale, your fingers relax, they get even heavier. Maybe they curl slightly. Your hands, your palms, your wrists. Now inhale, fill up that heart space. Maybe you give yourself a little gratitude or a little appreciation just for taking a couple minutes. And on an exhale, relax anything that you might be squeezing, tensing, holding on to. Tell yourself it's okay. It's a very vulnerable space. Go ahead and take two breaths to do this. It's a bigger space too. Now we're gonna inhale into your whole pelvic floor, your hips, all that space. Your belly, your lower belly. And exhale, relaxing. A lot of times if you are seated, we will hold tension in our hips, so allow this to let go. Take two breaths for this space too. It's a bigger space. I want you to inhale all the way down into your legs down through your thighs, your knees, your calves, your shins, and exhale any tension out of your legs. Fronts of your thighs, the backs of your thighs, your kneecaps behind your knees. If you need to take an extra breath for your legs, take an extra breath for your legs. Some of you are fortunate and you are much taller than me. It might take two breaths. And finally, Inhale all the way down to your toes, the soles of your feet, the arches, the heels, the tops of your feet, and exhale out your toes. If they're crunching, let them go. The arches, sometimes we hold tension. Sometimes you're on your feet a lot and they just naturally have tension. Notice if at any point your brain has gone on vacation. Have you gone back to the should-haves? Have you gone forward to the what-ifs? Just notice it, don't get mad at yourself. It is totally normal. It's never a question of if your brain is going to wander, it's always a question of when and how you're gonna deal with it. Notice it, tell it not, nah, not right now. Come back to your body. Give your body just a moment of awareness. Just recognize what's going on with interest and curiosity, but not judgment. And then take one big breath from your head, neck, shoulders, heart, arms, hand, belly, hips, legs, and feet. And then exhale all of it out, feeling the entire body let go and feel awareness of your skin from the front to the back to the top to the bottom. Just be aware. As you breathe in, Breathe in appreciation and gratitude and love for exactly what your body, head to toe, front to back, top to bottom is right now, today, with no judgment. That's a tall order, I know. I speak from experience. Be grateful for this body exactly as it is. 
because it is the only one you get. This is mindfulness and present moment awareness. You can take this awareness with you all day. You can practice this for five seconds throughout the day. Feel the feeling in your body right now. Just notice it. If your eyes are closed, I invite you to just flutter them open. Look at the world around you, whatever is in your sight right now. Take it all in. Hold that gratitude in your heart. And just remember that you don't deplete your love for yourself or your gratitude when you share it with others. So I invite you to share it with other people because one light does not get dimmer when it lights another light. So enjoy your day. Thank you for sitting in a mindful practice with me. I hope that it fills your soul a little bit. Hope it increases your gratitude and your joy and your freedom and all those wonderful things. And I wish you the best day. Peace out.